Alright, welcome to Joshua's Recordings where we're going to be taking apart this Chromebook by Asus. This is a 11-inch uh, Chromebook laptop with a Intel Celeron processor. And we're going to be seeing how it works and how we take it apart. And uh, so yeah, so first things first, we will power it off. <laughs> There we go. I mean, one thing about these Chromebooks is they're very quick to power off. Then we have these uh, 10 screws in the bottom which we'll have to remove and this will void your warranty. And now we're just gonna take a small screwdriver and start prying up along very these edges. Gently. Yeah, very gently. With care. Yep, because we actually care about Love. these turn computers. Mm. Here it comes. Leave and me. then you might want to mention how these this whole thing flips over. We're gonna take these little caps. Can they see that? I don't know. And flip them up. Whoops that. Just like so. And then pull it out. And this will be the inside of your Chromebook. Uh, in, this, oof. in the center here, you can see there's the battery. Over to the side is the motherboard with our amazingly large CPU cooler. <laughs> um, oh, that's it. Yeah. Wi Fi card, which isn't even standard. Um, and we have our huge hi-fi speakers on either side. Um, <laughs> and, the, and since it's a family system, that's why the heat sink's so large and small. And yeah, massive. Yeah. So, do you want to dig in deeper into this? Let's take it. Yeah. All right, so now you can tell the switcher. <laughs> all right. So now I have actually never dug deeper into this computer than this, so this will be an experience for all of us. I first, I think that We'll just remove these speakers. He'll All break right. his computer so you don't have to. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Over here in Josh's recordings, we break our computer so you don't have to. <laughs> Take these, uh, that out, then we have another screw here, this is held on by two screws, and then that one, and then we pop this whole thing out, and on this we see we got our USB 3.0 connector, one of the two that this laptop has, two whole USB connectors. More um, than the, Mac, the new MacBook 2016, 2017 edition. Absolutely. Um, and we got our power jack, a really tiny little power jack, and that is that board. All right, so now it appears that we could actually maybe just be uh, darn it, these spears don't want to come out. Um, all right, so now uh, let's take the motherboard out. So we'll pop that cable out. Folks, this is our wow. Oh, that <laughs> it also it's also what holds the laptop also down. The majority of the weight of the laptop. <laughs> yeah, right. All right. So here is the battery. Um, Josh. Yeah. You broke something off. Oh. Maybe. Where that came from? Probably a standoff. Must be. Oh well. We'll ignore it. Um. Now we need to like figure out a way to so this thing doesn't keep falling. There we go. It came into the battery design. It took an L. All right. One second. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Lousy. Oh. 
This is an Asus 7.6 volt, so very low actually. Volt, uh, 38 watt hour battery. Um, a very flat design on this thing, and most of it's plastic actually. So battery life lasts at least a week. Oh yeah. Standard use. Oh yeah. So basically, this is a 5,000 milliamp hour battery, um, and there's just a lot of cautions on it. So lithium ion. All right. So now we have the last component. If these speakers, will, these speakers come out. Hmm, they're really stuck in there. Look, they just snapped in there. Yeah, they're probably snapped. Yeah, exactly. They don't want to break the snap off. You gotta just leave them in there. Who cares about the speakers? They're junk. Motherboard time? <laughs> Alright, yeah, motherboard. Here. So, now the remainder of the computer consists of this single board solution for the motherboard. Um, so basically this is held in by what looks like four pass. remaining screws, or five remaining screws. <laughs> No one comment on how I touch the motherboard because it's my motherboard. Or actually, it's not. It's Mr. D's motherboard. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hardy. They'll, they'll take a beating. I want to put stickers all over my front. All over your motherboard? No. Yeah, right on the motherboard. All over my motherboard. All right, and then the motherboard, the motherboard just pops right out like that. And there's the other side. Here's our RAM. So it has one heat pipe. I was like, move a little bit closer yeah. in the camera. All right. Oh. So it has, this is our a mammoth heat pack. And I was right, this is our heat sink. That's or one of the, Or one of the heat oh, sinks. It's yeah, it's just, it's just a heat, heat spreader. Yeah. And then under this would assumingly be our CPU. So let me just take this. Uh... That's the CPU. Which is it? Is it Celeron or Pentium? Um, it doesn't it say on it. On it said Cel yeah, it said Celeron in the um. It says Celeron in the menu, but when you look at what the sticker yeah, they put, it says Pentium. So good job, Asus. Yeah, exactly. Lying to your customers. Sounds like a Mac. Yeah, it does. Dun 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 dun. Does this, this come off? Yeah, this comes off. All right, and also on the back you have this, which is also a heat spreader, and it just spreads heat from the back of the board. So that was quick. And that. Um, is our entire... Can you, do, can you do the screen? Yeah. Oh, it's screen time. Yep, so here is our amazing LCD screen, which is a 1366 by 768 resolution. Um, so not the best in the world, but not the worst. Um, but basically, it is a matte, matted screen, so it's anti-glare, as you can see by the light reflecting in it. Um, you got our webcam up there, which is just a cheap pinhole camera. Uh, but it doesn't offer horrible video functional. quality. Yeah, exactly, it's functional. Um, on the screen, the, the screen is held in by that screw, that screw, that screw, and that screw. So if you give us a second, we'll take those out. Can I see what those red letters feel like? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You can. Um, all right, so here we go. It says manufactured 16 slash 26. They hung up on me. Darn that. It's a telemarketing company. They call there a lot. All right, so the, the, the screen seems to be a generic screen. There's no... Uh, no branding on it. I'm zooming in on the uh, tag here. Focus. Probably try. Focus, you beep. Okay. Anyway, um, there we go. Let's focus. Um, so, on the back, we has manufacture date, uh, model number, and made in China, of course, because everything of low quality is made in China, um, or even high quality these days. Model number. Yep. All right. So, now. Just reverse the video and figure out how to put it back together. All right, so you got your white point out your. This is your Wi-Fi. Yeah, this is. These are your Wi-Fi antennas. Two of them. No. Nope. No, just, just one. one of them. Just one. Yeah, because your auxiliary line and main line. It's yeah. hard to about that. Oh, this is. Back now. This is a little module for the camera and the. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks we for watching. We might all as right. well. Shouldn't we? Like, might as well just record us putting it back. Together.